What's up YouTube? I am going to try and document my inverter project for uh, this Dodge truck installation and what I've got this is an overview this is a rather large inverter three fans it's gonna have two um, 15 amp outlets on it so to start this out I hope this shows up well Obviously it's not, so let me just tell you, this is a 2,000 watt continuous, 4,000 watt surge, uh, 12 volt, full 15 amp power inverter. Should be exactly the same as any of your household circuits. So you should be able to run things like a DeWalt circular saw or um, this saw right here, something that requires a... 15 amp input so this is the beginning of this project and I'm gonna make my vehicle a dual battery this is a Mopar battery that is a replacement battery for my vehicle exactly so I have two exactly matched Mopar AGM batteries these are 750 cold cranking amps 140 reserve capacity um, batteries and they're I'm going to hook them up in parallel and have a convert it into a dual battery package this is a two aught cable for this um, very it's marine tinned um, cable which means the copper is coated in tin so it's less susceptible to uh, corrosion and that kind of thing I have a uh, really nice lugs these are rosin core solder pellets that are designed just for each connection I'm gonna make they go down in there and you solder the cables in this is special heat heat shrink tubing for each lug connector that has a heat activated glue on the inside so besides shrinking down it's gonna glue and watertight seal this is all marine stuff uh, this this inverter to deal with the power it's going to have has uh, eight 30 amp circuits inside. They're they're not um, fuses. They're uh, electric uh, reset by themselves circuits. But eight times 30 is 240 uh, amps of power protection. And because of that, I'm going to install. This is a uh, an A and L C, uh, blue C A and L fuse block that will go on the positive side, and it will have a 250 amp A and L fuse to protect everything. Um, I've got two aught um, split bolts to connect the existing battery connections into the system. That's the ones in the front of the truck, the front battery. And then I've got to run this cable uh, under the cab and up in the back. And um, I'm going to have this outlet um, back here. Hopefully, I mean, all this is subject to change. But the plan is to have a, a 110, uh, you know, 15 amp outlet right there. I'm going to put the uh, battery box and the inverter inside the truck box and um, wire everything up. So this is the first shot of this project. Talk to you later. 